good morning vlog hello and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Jamie and welcome to my life today I'm starting a little weekend in my life it is also Martin Luther King weekend so it's a little bit of like three-day weekend so a little bit of a longer weekend in my life however I do have work tomorrow on Sunday because I work in athletics and that's what that's like but I'm going for brunch right now so let me show you guys my outfit I'm not even gonna lie I feel like this outfit is kind of a fit like it's just like I feel like I'm stunting uh, this top is from Free People. I have this Amazon turtleneck on underneath. Jeans are from Town Boutique. And then these shoes are so freaking cute. They're from Aqua and I got them at Bloomingdale's. <laughs> My apologies for not updating y'all. I basically got home and I got a text from this girl that kind of like shut me in my core about one of my exes. And I was like, hello? Um, so yeah, I stopped vlogging for a little bit. And um now Jacob is making a lot of noise, um, getting his um pork Gross. ribs out of his bag. Um Sorry, because we're eating Chinese food for dinner. We we're like feasting out and I'm so excited. Um, so let me show you guys what we got. So this is what I got. Chicken and broccoli with white rice. And then I also got some chicken fried rice too. Just, you know, because it's yummy. Jacob got short ribs with white rice. As well as an egg roll, which is over there. Good times. Good times. And we're going to watch Handmaid's Tale because I've already seen it. But I really, really, really wanted Jacob to watch it. So we're watching it together. We're currently up to season two so i'm starting to feel like my vlogs are just becoming like right where you left me the taylor swift song like i stayed there dust collected on my pin they expected me to what i whatever because like i just genuinely don't move like i have been at jacob's house for however many hours and we're still just watching handmaid's tale um but on the other note i have a florida traveled vlog uploading right now so like that'll be up when you guys have already seen this so like when you guys see this that will already have been up so definitely check that out if you haven't already we're still watching handmaid's tale for what it's worth it's 19 degrees outside it is like, it's so really 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 cold you can't really blame her vlog it's kind of i wouldn't want to go outside either yeah it's so cold um hopefully tomorrow will be more exciting but i'm literally just watching it already you guys uh sunday january 16th oh that's five months till my birthday how fun today st john's is playing georgetown at madison square garden so that is my vibe for the day that's what i'm doing it is a little bit later in the day it's 12 27 and i just finished getting ready for the day um because our game isn't until 4 30 so i spent the morning watching handmaid's tale on teleparty with my boyfriend and I love watching it. I also started watching Cheer this morning because the new season came out and I'm currently watching YouTube videos. Let me show you guys a little fit. So this sweater is brand new. My mom just got it for me. It's from this brand I think called Fate, which is in Farmingdale, I think by my house. I don't really know. Then I'm just wearing these leather leggings and then these shoes are the same ones I was wearing yesterday from Aqua. Um, yeah, I've just been trying to find more outfits that match with these shoes because they're so cute and I'm obsessed with them. I think I'm going to go downstairs now and eat some lunch and then check in. No. So a very happy long weekend to everyone. Um... Martin Luther King Day, so today I'm going to meal prep and get ready for the week ahead. Um, honestly, having this Monday to like recharge is so great. Love it. I wish you guys what I'm wearing. So I'm just wearing this sweatshirt. It's from Free People. I have um, a Nike sports bra on underneath. Leggings are from Old Navy. And then my bag is Prada. And then I'm wearing my Birkenstock slippers. Jacob's being very mean to me, everyone. We went to Whole Foods first instead of McDonald's. I'm very sorry for my gravest sin. I just wanted to die of coke. Look at Jacob putting away the cart. How cute is he? We just went to Whole Foods and got some stuff. I'll obviously give you guys a haul a little bit later. It's 10.49 now, so we're gonna go and drop off the food and then we'll pick up some lunch and then we'll make everything we've got. We're doing a balsamic chicken and a 
tomato and chicken pasta. All right, what's the um, not today. Um, can I just get a large Diet Coke? Uh, a large unsweetened iced tea. Okay. But can you add five Splendas to that? Okay. And uh, that's it for us. Thank you. I am so happy, happy. I'm so happy, happy. I'm. I think it's actually I'm so lucky. Is that the lyric? You are lucky. I'm so lucky, lucky, I'm so lucky, 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 lucky. Curly, curly, I'm so excited. Oh, this is my favorite thing in the world. We have thoughts, and we're gonna start. Jacob, share first. Hope you know a lot. This is the second take, because the first take didn't go so well, because I was cursing a lot about these people. At Core Life Corporate, you guys stink. Like, you guys just don't have any continuity of pricing in any of your stores, and, uh, it's illegal and uh, it's a real shame because what kind of corporate entity lets their franchises charge wildly different pricing than your own website? I could order on your website to this store and pay a different price than I pay at the counter because your people don't follow your own rules. And then they have the audacity to tell me, oh, the website is wrong. Well, then let me order on the website and pay a whole $5 difference, $4 difference. It's four dollars, but it's the principal. Do you want to explain the the issue? Core Life website charges extra money for things like cheese on a burrito. Oh, Core Life Farmingdale. Core Life Farmingdale charges extra money for things like cheese on a burrito. Things like any any other item other than lettuce and rice. They charge weirdly different pricing, and uh, when you message them about it and ask them about why their pricing changes from store to store. They don't answer you. Oh, and then they forget the broth in your broth bowl too when you order it online. And they say they're gonna send you gift cards, but they don't. I don't think anyone understands how happy this makes me. Like, it's so good. And Jacob got a burrito. I'm so excited. And obviously we've got some Handmaid's Tale playing while we eat. What's in your burrito? Chicken, rice, Previous tiny little bit of cheese, core life. <laughs> I didn't show you our full meal prep today, but I will show you guys what we made. Starting with this chicken broccoli balsamic kind of dish. So in this container, there's some shredded carrots, broccoli, chicken, and rice underneath it. I'll attach the recipe for that meal below, but we used balsamic vinegar, um, honey, garlic, just kind of whole mix and we baked it. And then the other dish that we're still working on is this chicken tomato pasta dish. So again, I'll attach a video for this one below. We have whole wheat pasta in this um, tomato, tomato puree, veggies. So there's like pepper in here and onions and garlic um, all simmered down. And then we just have um, like a Oop, you're all steamy now. We just have that chicken heating up. Um, so we can cut that up and put it in the sauce as well. Here's that final and pasta chicken dish. So good, so yummy. Oh my God, vlog, I just got my nails done and they're so cool. Look at that, they're like these like purple sparkles. I feel like a disco ball, I feel like the life of the party. I'm so here for it. But now it's 6.20 p.m. and I haven't eaten dinner yet. So I think I'm gonna order a Qdoba like to go and get it curbside, which is beautiful. The fact that they have that is amazing. Um, so I'm gonna get a bowl with chicken and brown rice and no beans and corn and lettuce and tortilla strips. And that's gonna be amazing and I'm so excited. Amazing, beautiful, stunning, delicious, and YouTube videos to go with. I don't know if talking about razors is like weird, um, but the razors I use are these Gillette Venus Comfort Glide ones. I like them because they have like the lotion on the outside, so it's really convenient. And so I just buy a big pack of like the heads and then I keep the razor and just click them on. So convenient. Um, and I like them because they have the lotion on them so you don't have to get shaving cream. So blew out my hair and then pulled it back. Um, my bangs right after I blow them out literally just make me look like a boy. But we take what we can get. 
I am winding down for bed for the night. It is only about 8.36, but I decided that I'm going to go to Orange Theory in the morning and try out taking class again um, with my knee. Um, if you didn't know, I have knee problems. My Orange Theory journey has been a little bit whack, so we're going to try again tomorrow and see how that goes. <laughs> so with that being said, good night. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. <laughs>